Hey there, Scott here with Saws on Skates. I just installed this box for a built-in dresser. Today I'm going to show you how I made the drawers for it. I started by taking some measurements. Download my drawer building handbook for tips about measuring for drawers. Next I cut some pieces of 1x6 for the front and back of the drawer. I mark the locations for pocket holes in the ends of each piece. Then I cut some pieces of 1x6 for the sides. Now it's time for some assembly. The bottom of the drawer will be quarter inch plywood. I could use my circular saw and Craig AccuCut to cut the bottom, but I left my AccuCut at a buddy's house. I could also use my circular saw and Craig rip cut, but the bottom of this drawer is larger than the cutting capacity of the rip cut. So instead, I cut the bottom with my table saw. The bottom was attached with glue and brad nails. Now we're ready to install the drawers. I want the drawer slides to be positioned in the middle of each drawer. To help position the slides, I cut some scrap wood to use as spacers. I test fit the drawers to make sure everything fit properly. Again, I used some scrap wood as spacers. Everything looks good, so now I can attach the drawer boxes to the slides. Next I ripped the drawer fronts to whip. Again, I could have made these cuts with a circular saw and the AccuCut or rip cut. Then I cut the drawer fronts to length. Next I test fit the drawer fronts to make sure everything was spaced properly. The fronts need an eighth inch of clearance on each side. I used playing cards to help with the spacing. When I was happy with the spacing, I applied some double sided tape on the back of the drawer front. The tape will help temporarily keep the drawer front in position. Playing cards help center the front from side to side. I drill the countersink hole on each side and attach the drawer front with screws. Next I use the Craig hardware jig to drill holes for the drawer poles. I used a sanding block to slightly round the edges of the drawer fronts. This gives the project a finished look. A couple of coats of paint and this project is done.